Dragon's Dogma. Hello guys, welcome back. It's Illogical as always. And today we're back on Dragon's Dogma 2. How would you expect, you know? So yeah, there was like... The last video was just longer than expected due to the fact of a death and me trying to find shit. So it was several... There were several problems. So there was... Right, are you going to try and get me to walk the entire way to Harv Village? No, that is not how this is going to work. I am not running the entire way. You can think the fuck again. Do you restock on these things? You do. I will be ensuring to make sure to buy one of them every single time I'm, I'm around. I need to stockpile those motherfucking things. Other than that there, we did get some very tasty upgrades. Let me just take a look, see what our questing is. So, you've got that there, which is weird to me. Saint in the slums, bring the... Uh, three mantis out, as she requests. How many do I have? I've only got one. And I need to kill ghosts for that shit. That is a nightmare. And you have to go, like, really up north. So you do, like, what I mean by really up north is, like... Or not even up north, it's over here. And I only did very mild exploration over here, so I did putrid cave. Oh, I why that was like I haven't even been here. I think it what was it? I got jumped on like here somewhere and then obviously the rest of it brought me to here and I'm just like for fuck's sake. So yeah. There's hard village that we have to go to. Probably need to pop back to Melv at some stage as well. There is so much to be done, I'm not even joking, guys. As I said, in the last one, we did get an upgrade. So, what we will do is, is we'll go... Fuck it, we'll go to her... Well, hang on. This is what we'll do, right. We'll go to the pub first. Right, that failed more miserably than I expected. We'll go to the pub first, right. There's a reason for this. Right, we're going to burn off a bit of time. And the reason why is because what I want to do is talk to the captain and get the next quest off of him. So we are. And that, that's sort of what the plan is here. Well do. Right, talk to me. Yes. Uh, I'll talk about Melvig again just to be... Okay. Never mind then, right? We'll write that without there. You got the masquerade, and then you got the queen regent. Which is like right now. Between midnight and dawn. So what we do is. I'm nearly also sure that I sold off that watcher armor didn't I? Which is a dodo move on my, on my behalf. That is an extremely dodo move on my behalf. I'm not even going to lie. Oh, my ho my pawn was taken. Nice. Receive all, put in storage. Literally, just keep killing Cyclopses. Is there even an item of value? I like, got the courtly gear, which is not. Give them something to health. Um. You'll not believe. Would the courtly gear even do? I guess this is where my problem now starts to come from is because now I have no cash. Go 
Get rid of that shite anyway. Get rid of any rotten stuff. Yeah, I'm currently skint. So I am. I do not have much money to go with. So that doesn't really help me think. Help me. Feeling rested, I trust. Well, what we can do is wing it and see if that works. Just straight up, just outright wing it, and then once we do this quest, then we'll do our. As I understand it, the pay of a jailer is miserable for all their toil. Probably. Um. Should the time come. Okay. Uh. Fucking pawns distracted me. Um. Right, I'm currently doing a quest. Uh, it's taking me to Mel Pangle quests. The plot, which the plot thickens. There's several more things that we need to do, but. Yeah, I know. Hence the reason. Re hence the reason I'm going. Come to admire my sculptures, have you? Oh, oh. Oh, to think my eminence as a collector would reach even the ears of the arisen. If only my collection were complete, I claim a life. Alas, the sculpture that I commissioned would be its centerpiece as yet, and would wound my pride to have you behold my collection. If your curiosity shall not be denied, however, mayhap you'd consider paying. The man's home is located in Bak Batar. You need only tell him that I eagerly await. We may benefit from pursuing the information. In Batal, where I have not personally been to yet. Uh, do you know how long it's. You are the Arisen. Yes? The captain gave me your description. Follow me. Okay, madam. No, so yeah, I've got like several issues that I need to deal with now. Which is always great funsies. I haven't even been to Batal yet, so how the fuck am I meant to know where the hell I'm going in that direction? Like, that makes no sense to me at all. It's the fact that you get sniped as you're running and just go, here's a quest, here's a quest, here's a quest, here's a quest, and I'm like, I don't have time for all of this. Pillaging. You're. Ooh, thank you very much. I needed that. So I did. Using a level of common sense would work. Hang on. I can't help but think it's strange pawns used to light her. I bet there are stones and droves, but I've not seen a single one for prepared some time now. It is difficult to imagine where they might have gone. I wonder if this bears reporting. Maybe because I exist? That might be a bit of a dead giveaway. Just to be clear. Just as a... Just as a point of reference, maybe? How the fuck do I get up there? Is it up, down, left, right? I need information. It's up, okay. Guest chambers. Ooh, how nice. Easy thievery. Oh my god, I've got fucking courtly everything at the mouth. Jesus Christ. Time to pillage. Yoink. 
Who's there? Oh, it's Sven. Pray, keep your voice low. Could it be good for either of us if someone was summoned to come check on me? Could it be that you have come to bring mother's schemes to light? I, Gisa is my mother. Call that. Forgive me for not telling you sooner. It was never my intent to deceive you. I simply feared that if I spoke the truth, none would wish to involve themselves with me. But that is no longer a concern. It is clear that we are alive and purpose. My word! You mean to say that you are the true Arisen? That the Sovereign currently residing in the palace is a pretender? Could Mother have had a hand in that as well? We each can spend a piece of wisdom from the chamber. Uh oh. Me? No, sir. Then start searching, you fool. Should aught befall the regent king, tis us who will answer to her grace. Lovely. Forgive me. My absence seems to have made this rather more difficult for us. You ought leave the palace at once. This room turned out little of interest. But I have a mind to look into this further. I shall send word to Captain Brandt if I discover aught you should know. I'll head out first and speak with the sentinel. Use that opportunity to make good your escape. Hide the window. For once a handy quest and a bit of backing up from Sven. Which I'm quite happy about. Like I said, it's like you never know what my people what, what people might do for you if you treat them well. But common sense I suppose is kinda of half the edict there, but it is what it is. Anyway, let's go cash this in and then we can make our way to Melv and then we'll backtrack and well, actually, we can fry stone to the other one because the other one's a, you can't act, you'll actually have to run to it, which is instantaneously problematic. So it is. So we're going to do it the slightly more fun way, I guess. That failed miserably. Okay. Anyways, and our quest completion. Sorry, guys. There is much we ought to tend to. If we are well, to how fared your mission? Was there aught suspicious to be found in the Queen Regent's office? One torn letter. This scrap. It was part of a letter. And from Batal, no less. This alone can prove little. But it is clear that Giza's schemes run deep. To think. Giza's actions have weighed even on the mind of her own son. It is a surprise. But a welcome one. Giza is a, the doting mother before the Regent King. If Regent King Sven is willing to aid us by drawing Giza's focus, we may be able to gain here more useful information. You have done well, Your Majesty. Though I am limited in the aid I am able to offer, I bid you. Thank you, and a wakestone to go with it. How lovely. Right. There's one more quest. Queen Regent Gisa appears to be working in concert with this face of fellow. Right, first off, we have to wait today. So let's take a seat and we'll wait today and then we will move out in the morning. We're going to head back to Melv and pray that everything goes to plan. Let's get our original gear back on, shall we? Oxcarts make for relatively safer travel. Yes, it does. Until you get jumped by a fucking griffin. This oxcart. I'll need to see some coin. Oh, don't you worry, you can have some coin. I got paid in my last mission, so I'm quite happy with that. Yeah, no, it, it, it it's all good until you get jumped by a griffin or a troll. Yes, I understand, but still, fucking mental. You just want a nice, peaceful journey, and then a griffin appears out of nowhere and jumps your entire cart. Get fucked. 
Right. Anyway. Malv, are you all in one piece? No fighting, no arguing, no bickering. Looks to be all in one piece so far anyway. I don't see any bickering or biting or... Arguing. Not from the looks of it anyway. Yep, we're all good. Okay, right. Let's just let's just take the easy route here and just use a fairy stone. Now, again, I know these things are freaking few and far between, but it has its uses. Okay. As it says, at least it can transport you to core areas. So it can. So I'm, I'm expecting this place to be built up now. So I am. Like repaired and refurbished and. There are risen. Thank heavens you've come. Saurians have claimed the village yet again. Just when almost all of the villagers had arrived as well. Oh. Oi! What are you doing standing about when there's work to be done? Jonas, this is the good sir I spoke of. The one who called the Storians. Is that right? Then I expect you to aid us with this. You did it once before, eh? Only my apologies for the chief's temperament. Yet he speaks truly. We pray, calm the beasts as you did before. Well, that's easy. I get to test that menu sword. Ah, this time it keeps the ice property, okay. See, ice is good because then you can just stun lock them. Once you freeze them, you can just stun lock them to death and it's just like, yes, please. Well, yeah, I've seen that coming. At least I'm not the only one fighting. Is that all of them dead? The Saurians are no more, I see. That's twice you've come to our rescue now. You're more than a friend to our village, Sir Arisen. Truly, we cannot... Here he is! I found our troublemaker! What? Jonas! What is the meaning of this? This blasted beast and went and ventured into Stormwind's cave! How many times have we said none are to tread there? But he just had to poke his nose where it didn't belong. There can be no doubt he's the one who incited the Saurians' attack. Forgive me. I never meant for any of this to happen. <laughs> Trust a beast to muck things up. Oh, you're an asshole. Jonas, surely there's no need for such talk. I agree. Yeah, you would say that, wouldn't you? Oh, he's an asshole. But I see him outnumbered. Could be all three of you are behind this somehow. Oh, you need dethroned. Jonas, please. You're being ridiculous. <coughs> I do apologize. I could see you <coughs> rather. Oh, we mustn't let this sour your triumph. You came to our aid when we needed it most. And for that, you have our... I do hope you shall visit us again. It was a rotten note to end things on. I wouldn't mind. But I wouldn't also mind going in and actually just tearing that entire um, hive apart. Hmm. Hang on, wait, what? Uh, visit. Ugh. I don't even know where the fuck that even is. Let me see. I got way off down to the south. Like, how the fuck? That's way down there. Fuck that. Well, the one advantage is at least I know of a hard spawn location for the dragons. Or a dragon. And we just so happen to find a Cyclops 
Don't ring through. I get immediately sat on. Thank you, game. Come on, up we get. Right. I want this thing to cope. Like, now. Did you just stagger him or break his tusk? You don't stagger whatsoever. I immediately get stood on. Mm. Did break his tusk. Uh, why do I keep getting st stood on? Seriously, the damage the damage on gouging strike is absolutely nutty, so it is. Like that's Oh Green Goblin, hello. Right no, the damage is nutty, so it is on that gouging strike. I love it. That done a lot more damage than I expected, I'm not even gonna lie. Come on, trolley. Come on, I need you to cope. Come on, I need you to cope. Ow. Come on, I need you to cope. Cope already. Cope already. Seriously. Come on. Down you go. Why did I come across all the big creatures? Look. I know we're going off on an adventure and all, but still. Down he goes. Now die. And the amount of damage I can pump out now is just absolutely glorious. I will just uh, attach to you and just keep wailing on you. There we go. Job done. Nice and easy. It's now getting to the point that these guys are maybe getting a bit too easy now. So they'll be probably be boring to talk about because it just seems to be just a just a pinch too easy now. Right, where are we stopped here, right? So let's see where else we can go. Obviously, bridge is broken, so we have to go up this way. So we're going to be hanging on the left. Basically, stay on the path and stay hang the left. And then we can move and see, just do some general exploring if we find a cave. Happy days. As I said, we're just sort of like semi burning time at the same time. So we are, but at the same time, though, if we can get any level ups, like, uh, no, no, what's this about? Like, another fucking Minotaur. Okay, you seem to be a lot more aggressive than the last one I fought. Right, come on.
Come on. Like, ouch. You hit hard enough. Step, 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 step. Minotaur horn. He's not going to be too happy about that. Oh, you want to start your charging? Yes, you are. I always meant to dodge that. Oh! Jesus H. Christ. Good thing there's a campsite right near me. Or else I would be a very dead man right now. That's what I wanted to see. Now that he's down on the ground, now we really badly wound him. Jesus H. Christ. Okay. That was definitely something. I really should stop exploring and now backtrack, but I'm way too fucking stubborn. So I am. I'm way too stubborn, and whenever I find stuff to pillage, it's just like it's like an ingrained need to just go. Is there any way to climb up there? I'm not sure what we'll find, but it might be something useful. Ring of acclamation. Okay. Right. So is this? Ah, it's just sorry. In terms of bombs. Okay. Which means that this upcoming fight is going to be up against Saurians. And the most unique Saurians that I've really found is the fucking... What do you call it ones? The stone ones? They are a nuisance. So they are. Let's just be very clear about that. The stone Saurians... So eh? Are a colossal pain in the ass. But... Let's go take let's go cave diving. Sure, that's a great idea. Cave. Collapsed mine. Proceed into the depths. We best be prepared to make our own life. And another different Saurian. Who definitely has a tankier fucking rhythm to him anyway. They're worth a good bit more too. Lovely. I'm starting to think I'm a little bit out of my depth right now. A different combination of materials results in different creations. That's okay, but as of right now, I'm starting to think I might be well out of my depth right now. I say we give it a push. Oh, it's really some goblins. Not gonna lie, I expected it to be far worse. Goblins at least are your starting easy ones left. I figured that you've been doing that all day. That's what I kind of. That's why you're the mage. That's what you're meant to be doing. Really? Fuck you, game. Right, anyway. What are you talking about? Oh, right, that's there. Okay, yeah, no. All I knew about that, that's okay, right. That seems to be like an on down path. Lots of mining to be done down there, though. Ah, okay. Let's get to it. Oh, some lovely gold ore. That works. I like that. Right, let's see what else is down here. I said I'm running low on health, so might need to get out of here at some stage. Head back and have a bl uh, slight reset and see what the situation is from there. So probably go and check up on a few other people as well. Mm, well, we've done our exploration for the day anyway, but we'll see. We've fought a new creature as well. So we'll have... 
I'll just say, is, goblins are not the, you know what I mean, like, they're not the most intensive creatures to fight. Which is always a bit disappointing, but, alright, what the fuck's going on over here now? What the fuck was that? Oh, that was a big goblin, okay. Bandits? Bandits! Fun! Oh wow. Bandits versus goblins. Awesome. Also, where am I now? I hear whenever I do this to myself, it's just like, I take one tunnel and it leads me to somewhere completely different. Goblins! Luckily enough, there's a campsite here. Okay. Who the fuck keeps smacking me in the back? I swear to fuck. You're going out of your way to be a pain in my ass at the minute. Happy days. I will always accept more ore. I will always accept more pillaging. Okay. Now the question is, do we explore at night? Or what do we do? As I said, we need that um, menachite stuff or whatever the fuck it's called. Malachite. So we do, we need it. Unfortunately, um, how do we go? I go. How do we go about doing that? Oh, hang on, merchant. I've got wares of every ill. Yes, that's good. Oh, hello. Unfortunately, nothing of interest though. Whereas I have gear to sell you, my friend. You can have that. Slightly higher defense, but no. Again, higher magical defense, so no. And no. Moderately boosts maximum health. Is that not the ring that I currently have equipped? And then, where takes more damage from ranged attacks from behind, but less hits from the front? Interesting. Doing business with you. Agreed. Slightly boost maximum health. Moderately boost maximum health. No purchases to be made today, I see. No. I just hope the shopkeep understands. Browsing was enough to stress. Trying to find this I think I need ghosts. And all I'm getting is goblins and saurians. What the fuck is going on over there? That's just a dude running for his life. Uh, away from Saurians, yeah, fuck that shit. Saurians just take too long to deal with. The goblin. Why is it every time I decide to travel at night, I am always on the verge of fucking death? I'm always on the cusp of death. Like, seriously. Every time. Every fucking time. Right, what was killed here? Okay. I guess we continue our exploration? Maybe? We get the buffalo guys anyway. There is random pawns out and about doing a little bit of exploration too. I, have a knack for gathering items and an I don't care. Finds. I don't know why you constantly, I don't know why they just constantly keep coming up to me and talking to me. I'm just like, why? But why is this place also covered in fucking pawns though? Holy shit. Oh 
The mountain road. Lovely. No. Very rare they do. Very, very rare that they do. Yo, level 22. More defense, more damage. I'll take it. Might be of use. I don't even know where the fuck I'm going. Apparently I'm traveling on an ox cart road anyway, so maybe we find an ox cart? Maybe. Or we find some warlord goblins. Game over. Not on the pillage, bitch. You missed, sir. What's with the triple volley? Holy shit. That's another big fucking goblin, too. That died more or less instantaneously. And Biggie got a level up. Where are we? So yeah, I'm heading towards an area that I've already been to, so that's something. We mustn't allow ourselves to become complacent. Take each trial as it comes. And now we got bandits. God damn it! Can you lot not just behave for two fucking seconds? Oi, bitch. An ox cart! Let's get the fuck out of here. This ox cart is bound for me to see some coins. Hundred percent, let's go. I'm not I'm really and truly not all that fussed right now. I don't care. We've done enough exploration, so we did. My only question now is, is what, where, 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 where does our quests line up now? Is the question. Like this is this is the this is where my big question is: is how and where does our quests line up? Yeet. Um. My magics are at your disposal. Let's do right. This is what we're gonna do, right? Considering we've already looked at this beggar quest once before, let's do this shit again, shall we? Because every time I try to do this quest, it flops. Like it, I, I don't know what's cause. I don't know what causes it. We done this. Like it took me like two hours to do this the last time. So I don't know why I'm gonna bother doing it this time, but I also know exactly where he's going this time, so I suppose it's a happy go lucky little bonus. Now listen close and your focus apply to this tale of a giant who touched the sky. Our hero is forgotten by history in spite of his words. Random guard outside the palace discussing a curious rumour. Oh, did it pertain to the Queen Regent and an important personage, perchance? Indeed. Some suppose there is more to her relationship with this Breton. You fraud! Leading a double life. You fraud. Deliver the beggar's garb. Um, any quests? Hang on. 
quests. The Helia or Helia is the tiger lady, isn't it? And then I think the other one is your. <coughs> oh, excuse me. The other one's your woman outside. I don't know why, but. Mm, I feel it's better to give it to the woman outside because that seems to be like the initial wife, whereas the other one seems to be in the most polite sense of the phrase. Like she, he is like don't get me wrong. Like we discovered that he was indeed a fucking. He was leading a double life. Like we knew that from the last time, that we attempted this. So we knew this already. So we did. Like that's not something new, but I do believe that the initial wife deserves to know more than the fraternizing wife. Is that the way that I want to say that? Here. I don't believe I've had the pleasure, sir. Have we some business I'm unaware of? Yes. Do you mean to tell me that Albert has been playing the part of a beggar? That man who would sooner starve to death than lift a finger in the pursuit of honest labor. If this is a jest, it is in very poor taste. All the same, I shall test the truth of your accusation, and who better to make it plain for us than Albert himself? I will place these clothes somewhere about the house. If he has aught to hide, his reaction when he finds them will doubtless be very telling. You may visit us again in a few days' time. Fear not. I have no intention. Okay, good job. Right, I'll pop back in a few days' time then. Right, let's go rest up and then call it a, call it a day at that, because that was an unnecessary headache. Trying to figure that out was a pain in my arse. So it was, but I, I was half right because I ran in after him. So I was half right and then half completely wrong at the same time. So we'll go sleep, call it quits, and see where the moral leads us. We'll see where the moral leads us because as it sits so far, oh, hey, hey, so much to do, so little time. The, 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 the fundamental game design of this one is a lot different than the original. I'll say that much, and that is what caught that is what is causing me sort of brain hemorrhaging at the moment. Normally you have like fucking quests, easy to access quests, to level up and so forth. But this time is completely different. Rest till, rest till morning. We should probably get around to updating our party as well, which would probably be a good idea. So we'll, be, we'll do that in the next video. We will get another, we'll get another party set up and we will go from there. So we will. Well, that sounds like a good idea to me. So, guys, I hope you all enjoyed. Please like, share, and subscribe if you didn't enjoy. And remember, guys, not everything goes to plan. Bye!